Some of the first photographs ever created were cameraless photographs in the 1830s and 1840s. It's where you use light-sensitive paper and you put objects on the paper and expose it to light, process it through chemistry or fix the image somehow, and you get an image that looks often like a silhouette or a shadow, depending on what the object was like. It really goes back to the very definition of photography, which is writing with light. It's a, a really exciting medium that you can explore so much with it without even using a camera, but it's not what people are most familiar with when they think of photography. I go to the dark room with bags full of stuff, beads and string and drinking straws, sushi paper, all kinds of objects that I know will make an interesting image as a photogram. It's a sort of ghostly effect. It's effectively a trace image, like a footprint in the sand. It's a, the image of the object that was sitting there left behind. Photography has always had women, which I think is an incredible part of the history. And so this exhibition, Modern Women, Modern Vision, really shows that, that women were there at the very beginnings of photography, where it became a very influential medium. I think it really shows you know, the important contributions of women to the history of photography by having this kind of linear narrative and timeline. So many iconic images that you know, I've seen reproduced, but not in person, are in the show. There's a quote by the artist Jean Cocteau. It's, I looked it up, it's from 1922. He says, I am the lie that tells the truth. I see photography that way, as this medium where it's a constructed image, and yet it has this truth quality because often it is a slice of life, an image of the world around us. There is a mechanical process to it. It does have these claims to objectivity, yet at the same time, it's an image that someone created, you know, a slice of life that they chose in the world, or in my case, in the darkroom. I'm grabbing objects and making a composition, uh, and you know, it's a, a real object that you might even recognize, but still, it's not exactly the truth. <laughs>